Okay, y'all. It's me. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. <coughs> okay. It's still my birthday, y'all. It ain't went nowhere. So, we're going to take another shot on this next video. All right. Look, I ain't even made a dent in my old nice Patron. I think that's the gold collection. I think that's what it said, but cheers. Okay. Now, hold on, y'all. Uh, I need to stand this phone up so y'all can, so I can show y'all what I'm talking about. But, but, you know what? These kids is look at my nerves today on my birthday. You know? Like, really, what's going on, children? I really ain't had nowhere to go, you guys, but uh, just here with the kids. Sorry about that, y'all. Okay, now I'm going to put this up. All right. Y'all, why do you like my breasts like big as hell in this damn thing? And no, it ain't not. I ain't got no... What I like in this here, I look like really like kind of chunky fat. Like, y'all, like, what's going on? And I'm a slim person. All right, this is my second wig, you guys. There was one that it was the color was so when I tell y'all it was beautiful, that color was gorgeous, you guys. Okay, now this is another video on my outre hair. And this one was, oh, I wish they would put the price. Okay, the price right here, $52.99. And let's see if the price is on this one. Well, I don't see the price on this one. Because the price was there, but I don't see the price. Maybe she charged me $52 for both of them. Which they both around $52. And they are actually... Um, human hair and lace, I mean, human hair and lace, human hair and, and, uh, what's the other hair that's in there? Y'all know, it's a mixture, okay? Uh, you get a little bit of shedding from that hair, from this hair, but, um, not like a lot, 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 but you do get some shedding from this hair. Okay, now. This one is called Rafa, Rafaela. This one is Rafaela. Okay. And this is the wig here. And this one is, also, this is all trade, some melted hairline. So I'm trying to see which one I want to wear first, y'all. Is that one or that one? And then I right hear it says, um, frontal effect hairline. No, it says no plucking required. Uh... It says re redesign comfort fit ear uh con ear contour. So um we're gonna have to see what the ear contour is because see they show you right here what the ear contour is and then they show you here. Okay. So I'm gonna take it out the bag. And this is my birthday gift to me, which is the hair, because I need my hair done for work. So I was going to do my hair today, you guys. I gelled my hair down, and I had put a cap on, and then I put this on because my hair was still wet. So I was trying to get everything to just lay down. Because y'all know, if you do not lay your hair down, when you get a wig, especially if it's not freshly permed, okay? But if it's freshly permed, then y'all know you good. But if it's not, you know, you need some gel to lay that stuff down. Because guess what, baby? Let me tell you, y'all know that puff going to be uphill. And y'all already know, look like you, look like you, somebody did a bad job on your head. Because y'all know, when you put the wig on, you know how it be puffy up here, even though you pull it down right here and you do the adjustable straps? It's still puffy up here, and it just don't look right. You want it to lay flat. All right. So, um, let's go with this one. Now, here we go. Oh, it just came right on up the thing. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. 
Here we go, y'all. Now, I like this. Now, y'all see it has the... Now, this is the, the little white cord part that's up under here. But you guys can see that hairline. Now, it looks like... Here, you guys. Hold on. Hold on, yeah. I like because you got to take this little... I'm not going to take it off all the way because I might wear this. I might put this one on. But you see, I like how you can actually see through here. But now, y'all know they had a fake fake part um, stuff, piece of tape or something that you can put on there. Uh, me, I'll just put a little makeup. That's about it. And put it in. Do it in. Okay? Um, But, okay, this is the wig here. I wish it says it's a 1, 1B, one 2, and 613 Cocoa Caramel Dr. Red Velvet. Oh, that's just a different one. My bad, y'all. This is a 1B. Don't need to drink no more Patron, y'all, because mm, I'm seeing like something ain't right. Now, I'm going to just take this card off of here so I can show y'all what, what it's saying. I'm not really worried about it. Okay. Now, for the card, um, now, I like the way her hair is laying right here, okay? That's why I say that hey, your hair got to be down. So, maybe what she probably did, which would probably be, probably be a good idea, well, idea, idea. I've been drinking a little bit today, y'all, so excuse my language, my, my slurriness, okay? Um, what she probably did, which I think would be a good idea for us ladies to do, part our hair down the middle so far and lay it this way and lay it this way. So then when we put on the cap, because some ladies don't use the cap, okay? And nothing wrong with that. Because you got the cap, you got what is gel down with, you got the cap. And some of us ladies have dry scalp, dry scalp to where uh, we have to scratch. And y'all know y'all need that little rat tail comb. I ain't talking about the one that's all thick. I wish I, could, I wish I had that comb with me here. But, no, you need the one with that metal end to get down off of there and get the scratch real good. Because that joker right there... Ladies, y'all already know that do the job, honey. Mm-hmm. That do the job, honey. Mm-hmm. That do the job. Because I know it do the job for me. Because my scalp, I can grease my scalp. And that same day, my head going to be itchy, 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 itchy. Okay. So, it comes in different colors. And see, I'm back here. Here's the different colors here that it comes it comes in. Not with Y'all forgive me. It come in, okay? It comes in different colors here. Um, and it's just the way you wear it is, you know, down this down this way. So, um, I'm trying to see which one of these wigs I'm gonna wear for. Maybe this one. I'm kind of, I'm kind of like and this one, but I like the other one. But I'm gonna try this one, you guys, okay? Um. And I'm going to try to make sure I keep it up and it's going to be soft. It is soft. So, we're going to look at it right here, you guys. We're just going to take it down out of the, this here. I'm keeping my, my bag or whatever. Y'all know y'all keep this hair net. So, if you're working in the kitchen somewhere, baby, that go your hair net. All right. Now, we're going to look at this. Now, this is fairly long, you guys. Like, wow. This is fairly long. Um, then here goes the little thing that come in it. Um, okay. So I'm not going to take it and see how I, now this is what I like, you guys. I'll tray, yes. Y'all see how they have these little metal things? These is metal. Y'all see how they have that, what that's holding on right there? I like that. Because you know the ones they always, either they have it and it's them plastic clips be on there. But these I like because, hey, it's, it's. It's holding on, and it has the adjustable strap, just as the other one does. And actually, it's wide enough, too. So, 
Maybe the just the, and then the adjustable straps when you put it on, you can put it under here. You don't have to worry about that comb. But now, what I'm gonna tell y'all about this one is that this one, you don't see the lace like you do the other one. There's no no lace. What I was showing y'all with the other one on the other video, there's no nothing up under there. So, um, it's not. So, but it's nothing there. Now, what you could probably do if you're a person that wants to have a whole 360 where you may want to glue down all the way. Only thing I could probably say is go buy some of the Swiss lace and get your needle and thread and just sew right across here. And if you sew right across here just enough, when you cut it, you'll be able to lay that down if you want it to, to stay, stay. So that's another thing I would say do. Take go purchase some lace um and put the lace here and sew it down with some black thread. But make it neat enough so when you put it when you get ready to glue it back here, then it'll um you know, it'll stick. But you may not need a whole lot. So you would actually do it just right at this brim right here. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. And you know, you see the little baby hairs here in the wig. You're going to see the you see the baby hairs here. Um, and like I said, it looked like it could do to be a little, have a little more plucking there. Uh, parting and then pluck or maybe just a little pluck. Because see, some of it looks a little uneven, you guys. Y'all see how it seems like it looked a little uneven? Like right up in here or here. Okay, but it is a soft, it is very, very soft, you guys. Like soft, soft. Smell pretty good, so we're gonna check it for shedding. Um let's see, it gets a little tangled. So not not too much shedding, just a little bit, you guys. That's just like one little piece. So I think what I'm going to do is, and actually, it's not a lot of lace that's on here, as you guys can see. It's not a lot of lace that's here, but you see if you get it laid down well enough, you know, if it, if, if you could do it and it lays down, it looks like it will melt for your, melt into your skin. You see how that, see that, how that is? But, y'all, I think I'm going to start with this one when I get ready to put it on, y'all. This is going to be the one that I'm going to put on first, okay? And then when I do my next video, I'm going to come back with that one. But I'm going to... Now, what I will not show you guys is my cap when I put it on. Because I have sometimes have an issue with that. Um, So, and I know a lot of you ladies know how to put the cap on. And then they do have the beginner videos here on youtube where it show you how to do the cap a lot of and you know i'm gonna tell you glamazante she's on here and this is something that i did before she did it okay what i did was pull my cap all the way down and i cut the little holes and i'm pretty sure maybe a lot of us already did that too just never thought to put it on youtube like she did so now it makes it seem like she just thought of it or she's the first person to think of doing it to like she's the first person that brought it out so everybody gives her the kudos on that and maybe those people are the ones that who just never thought of it but that's something that i've done before she put it on there and this is nothing against miss glamazante because that sister she be doing her thing and I'm going to tell y'all, she went and got a butt lift. She went and got her butt done. And if I tell y'all, y'all come across Ms. Glamazante because she does have videos on there of her butt lift. I'm going to tell you, whatever doctor she went to, if I was a little bit younger, I had to get with her because I want to go to that same doctor. Because on her, a lot of her videos, when she does her clothing videos... You don't see no scars. See, some women you can see a scar or something on her. Now, they do have the makeup that you can put on you as far as that. But I'm going to say, no, nah, she not putting no makeup on her ass. Just tell y'all that now. She not. 
her stuff is is not and and it looks so natural on her. If she never, if y'all came across her videos and you never came across her butt lift video, and she never told y'all, you would never know. If you just saw her out and about, you would never know that she had her butt done because that doctor did his thing, uh, with her uh with her surgery. I mean, he did that. I don't know where she... I forgot where she went, but it'll, t it'll tell you if you look up Glamazante uh, and look up butt lift or plastic surgery or something like that, it'll come up where she went. And I'm going to tell you, that doctor did, did that sister there. Damn good. Now, she, she's a lesbian on there. She's, she's a pretty lady. She's a nice lady. She sells clothing, and I actually need to get some of her clothes. Um, but she... um. She real cool. She funny as hell. She dried a boat. Oh, baby. <laughs> but, yeah. But, um, her surgery came out. Her surgery came out good, baby. Because if I was getting my butt done, I'd have, like, glasses. I'd say, girl, what doctor you went to? Because, baby, I'm going to the doctor you went to. But, uh-uh. So, I just want to, I'm going to leave y'all with this. Um, like I say, it's my birthday, y'all. Hey, June 26th. Mm -mm. So I'm going to say here, I'm going to give me another shot or two in before I go to bed. But when I get ready to do my video, you guys, um, I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to show you guys me putting this one on and styling it. And then I'm, I need to do some makeup, you guys. I've just been, y'all, I'm going to tell y'all, um, I've been out of it for a while but it's also been hot when i tell y'all so hot here in houston it has been like really really hot here in houston i could do my makeup you guys um but it's been so hot and y'all know and see i do security so i'm outside i'm inside and we can't just sit inside all the time we have to go outside and patrol and and, and i do have a car with air but baby Y'all, I'm sorry. That makeup be hot your face. Because I know I put on some makeup one time going to work at the Toyota Center here in Houston. <clears throat> and if I tell y'all I had to put on my glasses and my glasses start sliding. I'm like, man. So when I took my glasses off, the little notches right here, they had makeup on them. Makeup started messing up. Um, started melting. And it's so hot, y'all. Um, for makeup, I promise y'all, it is. Now, when winter time start to flow back in, but I'm going to do some makeup videos. I've just been out of it, you guys. But I'm going to do some more makeup videos for y'all. Um, coming soon, so y'all stick in there with me. Uh, I'm, don't you hear I'm busy, child? So, um, I'm going to do some more makeup videos. I am going to do some makeup videos for you guys. Uh... I just get myself together for that because it's like, wow. But I'm going to do this hair video and then, uh, not tonight, but I, I'm going to do this hair video to show you guys this wig. The hair is super soft, you guys. It's not that like that plastic, what you guys would think. But this, when I tell y'all it's soft, it's like really, 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 really soft. Some soft hair. Um, and it is a mixed fiber of synthetic and human. But it's if it's really soft you know and it you can manage it and keep it up but i'm gonna do the video on this one tomorrow and um but i'm gonna say but i'm gonna say i'll talk to you guys later but this is i think this looks like about a 20 inch it is really long about a 20 inch but you guys it's a pretty wig and um and i'm gonna fix it right it's gonna be done right but I'm going to holler at you guys later because I'm getting sleepy. And I want to say thank you all to whoever come across my video and wishes me happy birthday. Thank you guys so much. Um, like I say, in the comments down below, just, just let me know uh, what you guys think of these wigs. And I am going to do the wigs. And I have 66 subscribers now. And I want to say bless you all. And thank y'all. I love y'all so much. These giveaways is coming back in July. Because my birthday is today. So y'all know July is coming up soon. And guess what? 
I'm doing them giveaways again. Um, so, like I say, if anybody runs across this video and you want to subscribe to my channel, you can subscribe to my channel. Uh, just let me know that you are a new subscriber and put your uh, Instagram information there. So that way I'll be able to reach you through Instagram. Because once I told them, I said on my station, uh, Gmail and something happened and I'm not trying to scam nobody. I'm not trying to get into nobody's information, take nobody money or, or nothing like that. I don't know what happened. And I just said the wrong thing and they took off my comments. I mean, they, they uh, did it to where nobody could comment. They turned off the comments. That's what it was. Um, so just put in your Instagram information so that way I'll be able to reach you. And like I say, come July on, we're going to be doing this. These giveaways, y'all. So, y'all got to hang in there with me. Stay tuned with me. Stay with me. And I got y'all. And, hey, guess what? I might put a little something extra in y'all bag. And I'm not going to tell y'all what it is. So, um, that's about it, you guys. But, um, I'm going to see y'all back soon for this video here, for the hair video and my giveaways. So, Y'all going to know when it's giveaway time. I love y'all, YouTube. I thank y'all for supporting me. Um, and I also support any and everybody out there that I come across for their videos. Um, and I want to say, hey, vibing with E and J. How y'all doing? Uh, hey, Nettie. Hey, Riri. Um, and a couple of other ladies. I want to say hey to y'all. To my last two winners, to my only two winners that I've had, but I'm going to have more winners. So you guys just hang in there with me. I hope y'all have a great rest of y'all weekend. Be easy, be breezy, and guess what? Don't get in no trouble. All right? Hey, it's better to let them go than to let them stay. So, hey, because when you let them go, your life is going to be easier. If you let them stay, your life is going to be hard. Okay? So, love y'all, and uh, like they say, people sometimes is just here for the season. Not that they meant to stay; it could be just seasonal. But once it comes seasonal, it's hard to it's kind of hard to separate that. But y'all will make the right judgment. Love y'all, YouTubers. Uh, this your girl Eva. Peace out, and I'll holler at you guys later. Bye.